Did you know that over the last 40 years, as women, we've actually started to get less happy, even though now we can have it all. And men, well, they're getting happier. So let's go talk to some people and find out why. We put the pressure on ourselves to do more, to give more, and sometimes it discontinues to grow. Because it's more requirements on women these days than it was back in the old days. The women could stay at home and just take care of the kids and cook and things like that. I think we work too hard. We work at work and we work at home. And um, I think also some people are getting less happy because of competition. Hi, I'm Valerie Burton, author of Happy Women Live Better, 13 ways to trigger your happiness every day. You know, in my conversations with women from all walks of life, whether they've got a stellar career and no kids, or they're a stay-at-home mom of five, it really echoes the same refrain. I feel like I should be doing more. Um, somehow I feel like I'm missing out. I feel like I need to catch up. There's this angst that so many women are experiencing. It's the pressure to constantly be doing more, living up to these very huge expectations. But here's what I've learned from research, from my work as a life coach, and from my writing. Happy women learn how to be happy not just when they get what they want, but they learn how to be happy while they're waiting for what they want. So what triggers your happiness? When I have a job to go to and I have something that I'm looking forward to for the future and I'm helping people. The biggest things for me internally is to work out and to spend time with my family it makes me very happy. My job makes me happy. I'm an English teacher and just being with the kids every day is a joy, usually. <laughs> Happiness is really not just about your circumstances. Happiness is about the intentional choices that you make every single day. And that's why I've created these 13 research-based happiness triggers. These are tools that you can use to trigger your happiness on a daily basis. So what do I mean by happiness triggers? There are 13 of them. Let me share just a couple with you. One of my favorites is anticipation. So anticipation is just your declaration that Every day I have something to look forward to. When we have something to look forward to, it boosts our positive emotions. This is so huge in our culture today. It's connection. You ought to be able to say, you know what? I talk to my family and friends more than I type and text them. So what are your triggers? Go out to happywomantest.com and you can find out your personal triggers and your power triggers for free. I want to help you be happier and have more fun even when life seems routine bounce back from stress and adversity, enjoy deeper satisfaction in your marriage and your friendships, and fight off depression, illness, and even live longer. And once you've done that, I want you to spread the happiness. Join me and thousands of women in a movement to reclaim our happiness, because happy women live better.